after America's Defense Secretary admitted U.S. failings in Afghanistan last week, the Pentagon seems to have been looking for somebody to blame, and it's found someone. In its first report to Congress since the election, the Pentagon named Pakistan as the single greatest external factor hindering U.S. actions. The report refers to what it calls support of Afghan insurgents by the Pakistani government. During 16 years of its involvement in Afghanistan, Washington has given a range of reasons why its Afghan campaign wasn't going to plan. Iran is reportedly arming and funding the Taliban. Corruption um, is a huge challenge in Afghanistan. Russia is now meddling in Afghanistan. It's very difficult to succeed on the battlefield when your enemy enjoys external support and safe haven. We had the uh, overt legitimacy lent to the Taliban by the Russians. The problem that the U.S. has in, in trying to carry out the, the occupation and subdue uh, the population, I mean, the real answer here is the U.S. has to get out of Afghanistan. They claim that they would have resolved everything and they would have won the war uh, if only it wasn't for Pakistan or only if it only wasn't for something else. But they're always looking because they, they aren't able to succeed. The problem that they have in a war that has lasted longer than any other U.S. war in history, almost 16 years now, is the fact that the, the Afghan people do not wish to accept occupation. America's attempts to settle the Afghan crisis have seen several surprising methods being used in the past. We're not winning in Afghanistan right now. Godfrey, you look like you're on a cruise to the South Sea. Oh, thank you. The Pentagon paid $6 million to buy nine male Italian goats because they're blonde in color. Now, the Pentagon doesn't even know where the goats are. They might have been eaten. Is there any justification for $20 million in Afghan firewood? When my auditors asked for documentation, they were basically told, quote, unquote, we don't have the records, we just spend the money.